Okay, now that we've gone ahead and created our parent-teacher conference calendar, we've set our notifications, and we have created our appointment slots, now we're ready to submit our calendar links to the Department of Innovation. So from the district homepage, we're going to select Department of Innovation, and I already have that tab open here. From the Department of Innovation page, we're going to select Reports. And about three-fourths of the way down where it reads parent-teacher conferences, submit your parent-teacher conference calendar links. We're going to go ahead and click on that. And this will bring us to the, to, uh, to the utility where we will go ahead and copy and then paste our links. Okay, we just want to go ahead and keep this page open. We want to go ahead and go back to our conference calendar. And again, indicated by the colored block. I've kind of uh, just displayed only this calendar where all other calendars have been minimized or are hidden for the time being. Once I am on my calendar, I want to go ahead and hover my mouse over the small triangle again to get my drop down menu. I then want to go to calendar settings. And if we scroll down, we will see third from the bottom where it says calendar address. If you look to the right, you have three colored blocks. We want the third colored block, which is blue, and we want to go ahead and right click on where it says HTML. We want to hover our mouse over it, and by right clicking on it, we want to go ahead and copy link address. So we want to go ahead and copy link address. On yours it may indicate copy link address. On mine it says copy link location and that's okay too. But what we want to do is we want to go ahead and copy this particular where this link is located and we want to go ahead and paste it onto the page that we have left open. So we want to go ahead and go back to our uh, Department of Innovation page on the submit the links page and we want to go ahead and choose our particular building. In this case, I use Greentown as my building. And then we'll want to go ahead and go to paste the link to your parent-teacher conference calendar below. So I want to then right-click inside that space, and I want to go ahead and choose Paste, and it will then paste that address link that I've copied from my calendar and paste it within this particular box. What I then want to do is I want to go back to my calendar because then I want to go ahead and get the link address to my appointment slots. And when I do that, I'm going to go ahead and go back to the calendar in the top left hand corner where it says back to calendar. I want to go ahead and select that. I want to locate this large block of, of uh, appointment that I have and I want to click on edit details. And it is this long hyperlinked address that I have here where it says this calendar's appointment page. So I want to go ahead and again, not click on it, but right click on it. And I want to go ahead and copy link location or copy link address. And I'm going to go ahead and select that. I want to go back to the Department of Innovation page where I copied and pasted that last one. And I want to scroll down and where it says paste the link of the appointment slot page, I want to go ahead and click inside there again. Right click using my mouse and paste that address that I just grabbed from the appointment slots and that address link and I want to paste it with inside there. When you are completed, we want to just go ahead and review that we have first our building indicated so that we can link your calendar and your appointment slots with your particular building. We want to go ahead and make sure that we have pasted the calendar link. And then finally we want to make sure that we have then pasted our appointment slot link. Once we have completed both of those tasks, and then we want to go ahead and click on submit. Once I go ahead and click on submit, I may have to click it twice. And if I scroll up, I will get an indication indicating that your responses have been recorded. And this is a confirmation indicating that we will then receive 
your appointment slot address and your calendar settings link address.